Let me see, you're trying to get some of these noodles, huh? Do you want to try? Um, no, I can't give you that. Hey guys! Okay, so I just got back from Koreatown. I live in LA in case you guys are wondering. Um, and I want to show you guys what I got at H Mart. Like, just a few like, little things. So, I got instant black bean noodle. The caldo version. I really like that version. Or, I like this brand. I haven't tried these noodles yet. I've actually never had black bean noodle yet. And um, I got these kimchi dumplings with pork. And these things are like huge looking. I think these are bigger than the ones I had before, so I'm very excited about these ones. I think the other ones I had were vegetarian. Um, I got more noodles. I got some more kimchi ramen. I love this. This is the one that I had mukbanged in before in the little, um, in the bowl. I got some nuclear fire noodles, the cheese version from Some Young. And then I just got some pickled radish. And I also got some whole uh, kimchi. Oh, and last but not least, I love these. Korean yams. If you haven't tried these, you should get some. They're so good. They're like really sweet. They're sweeter than regular yams. And then, okay, you guys, you already know where this is going. I got jajangmyeon. Uh, I got it from this place called Zamong. I think it's like a Chinese Korean place. And we are going to mukbang it, and I've never had it before. I've had like the nuclear fire black bean noodle, but I've never had real jajangmyeon. So, very excited. I'm going to set up, and then we are going to eat. Also, what do you guys think of my shirt? It says, take a, it says, take a picture like I'm not looking. And then there's like a man and a dog, and they're like not looking like, take my photo. <laughs> I think it's hilarious. Anyway. I'm gonna set up to eat this. I'm so hungry and excited. All right, let's see what they gave us. Looks like pickled turnip, maybe. Pickled radish. Like the bunch on. Is that, is that how you say it? Bunch on. Noodles. I think I need to heat these up though. And then this is the sauce. Oh, the sauce is so really hot. Okay, I'm gonna get a plate, you guys. Put this one. Mm, what is this? What is that? Can somebody tell me what this is, please? I don't. It's not a familiar taste to me. Hey guys, I am back. Okay, the noodles are nice and hot now. Yeah, I'm so excited. I don't think I've ever been so freaking excited. Like honestly, I've been dying, dying to try Jar Jar Bun. And every time I try to go, it's like, it's so hard to freaking get to K-Town. Mmm. Oh, baby. Okay. Sauce. So this is like their traditional. Jajang yang. I don't know. I really am curious as to what this stuff is. It's sour. And then, I just have some dumplings on the side. Um, they're the BB Go mini dumplings. There's some sauce. Okay. Let's give this a go. I'm so happy. Am I gonna love you guys? Am I gonna love it? Honestly, nothing really makes me happier than noodles and dumplings. Isn't that like... It's just like, like the best, the best things in life. Noodles and dumplings. Ooh! Okay. 
Oh, that is so good. Mmm. I love it. Mm-hmm. Pickled radish. Mm-hmm. Look at these little guys. Should I put the radish on the plate? <laughs> like how they Stop, Lucy. Can you please stop? Put the radish on the plate. These little, oh, it's onion pieces. Little onion pieces. Uh uh, Clacy, please come here. Please come here. And then they also gave me some little, um, what is this? Kimchi radish? Mm, I love kimchi. Uh, I should take a picture. Okay, that's quite enough. Let's see. Let's see. This is really good, you guys. I don't have anything to compare it to. I'm the only thing. So I can't say, like, how good it is, but I really like it. This place had really good reviews. Um, no, and it had a lot. Um, I think I just told you guys, did I say what it was called? It's called Zamong, Z-Z-A-O-M-N-G. I'll leave the link down, the Yelp link down below. In case you guys want to get some too, when you're in the LA area. Okay, I'm going to try some of this sauce. I'm kind of confused. Am I supposed to put this on it? Mmm. That's nice. Mmm. -hmm. What is this stuff, you guys? Someone help me tell me what it is. This stuff is so good. Oh my god, I love black bean noodle. I love black bean noodle. This place also had nuclear fire black bean noodle. And there's different levels. Like I think it went up to level 10 or something insane. I kind of wish I got it. Should I do the nuclear fire challenge, you guys? The two times spicy? I've actually done it before, before I started my channel. Me and um, my roommate slash bestie, we did it. Um, and <gasps> we tried to race each other. Because we saw Tammy Hamburg do it. And we were like, oh my god, I'm going to try this. This is before I knew like what mukbang really was. Mm. so we bought the noodles and we did it and our friend recorded us racing honestly it was a disaster 
disaster. We were screaming like, <sighs> should I put in, should I post the video of us doing it? It's honestly embarrassing. We were both like screaming our heads off. And then to top it all off, we finished. But there was like noodles like literally in my hair because we were racing and I was like being really messy about it. Almond milk flying everywhere. It was like literally almond milk in my hair, almond milk all over the counter, almond milk on my shirt, hot sauce all around the mouth, red lips. And I freaking, <laughs> we like finished the almond milk. And so what do we do after that? Well, our kitchen has two sinks. There's like the regular kitchen sink and then right like outside the kitchen is like a little wet bar area. So each one of us has our heads like in the sink with like water running through it. Little do we know that water activates it more. Man, it was just pure chaos. And then like our friend who's filming us is just like behind the camera laughing. We really wanted to beat each other. <laughs> oh my god. But yeah, the pain from those noodles, it like lingers for like 20 minutes. If you've ever had them before. It's not like you eat them and then it's like you're in pain for like, I don't know. 10, 20 minutes, and then you're good after that. But then like, you pay for it because your stomach hurts after that. I don't wanna do it again, should I? Yeah, maybe I should. And like, my stomach hurts, should I do it? It hurts your stomach. I don't know what this stuff is, but I like it. It's like fermented something, I think. It's very nice. These noodles are so like rich. It like makes it nice and like tart. So you guys, it finally happened. I got a complaint about Khaleesi's barking. I feel like she's been getting a little bit better since the complaint because I've really been on her to stop barking. There she is right there. Um, but I've honestly seriously been considering getting her. Is this cruel? One of those barking collars, the shock collars. I think they want to like vibrate and not shock them. I don't know you guys. I feel so awful doing that. Like is I just wanna do you guys think it's inhumane? I mean if I were to get it for her, I would like have to test it out on my like my arm burst to see like what the pain is like. So, like I don't wanna hurt her. That's just awful. She's looking at me like what do you what do you say, bitch? Yeah, you better not hurt me. Wait, this dog has it so good. Look at her. Look at her. On my couch. Okay, Missy. Oh, excuse me. So good. Look at her. Living her best life. So these noodles were actually really inexpensive. They were seven dollars. Seven twenty. I think uh, with tax it came out to like eight twenty five. I think they were like seven ninety seven something. And then with tax, I paid eight twenty five. Well, that's not bad at all. 
It's a really huge portion. And I'm, I'm trying really hard to finish this, you guys. There's pork, onions, and zucchini. Very good. Mm. Alright, you guys, that's it. Your girl is tapped out. That's all I could really eat right now. Mm. But, very good. <laughs> I feel like it kind of has. Oh my god, don't crucify me for saying this. It kind of has like a chow mayony flavor, but like more luxurious because of the black bean. I'm curious to try the spicy version, the fire one. I might try that next. Anyway, you guys, thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, yeah, and please subscribe, of course, only if you want to. Um, and please give this video a thumbs up if you want to. Thank you guys so much for watching and oh comment down below what foods you think I should try next like something I've never tried before. Um, anything. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching.